Hello, welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to make the two in one light and motion sensors. So this is the schematic. This circuit or this schematic has three different or three main parts here. This is the first part, this is the light sensors, and then this part, the right, this is the peer sensor, the passive infrared, and then this part in the middle, the center, this is the output. I'm using light here, but actually you could change this output to alarm, buzzer, speaker, or doorbell, or whatever you like. So the basic principle of the circuit or how this circuit works is when the light sensors detect that there is no light or when the night comes or your environment getting darker the current will flow here to activate the motion sensor the peer sensors and when it detect movement it will light up the output lights up light Okay, so it will only works at night and when only motion or movement detected. Okay, so let's simulate the circuit to see if the circuit is working. Let's say that this symbol is a flashlight. Just consider this as a flashlight and let's make it closer to the sensor nothing happened and then when it's get further or getting darker see the light is on of course with a note that motion are detected Closer, brighter, darker, brighter, darker, day, night. There are few things that you might need to know. The first that this RV1, it's mean variable resistor or trimmer or potentiometer. The higher the value of this, it will make the light sensor much more sensitive okay you can use or change this value to any value you like or simply use potentiometer for simpler or to make it much easier to adjust and then the next part will be here I'm using tip 41 this uh, transistor used as a current enhancer because the current flow from the circuit is slightly low so I have to enhance it or to make the power the current power bigger so I'm using the 41 here and then this BD139 transistor this one too it doesn't matter if you want to change this transistor to any model you want of course it has to be NPN transistor and then this part relay why do I use relay here because the current flow from this peer it will not able to lift or to, to make the light on because the current flow from here will be so low so I just use this output from this peer just to turn on the relay and then the relay will act as a switch to lights of the light okay and so that's it that will be all I hope you like this schematic and of course you could use this schematic to make your own electronic device and the schematic is not just uh, a simulation but this schematic has been applied to a real device as shown in the video in the first opening video. I hope you find something interesting from using this circuit. 
let me know if you find something if your kit detects something unusual of course this spear sensor will detect human movement cats or something ghosts maybe or whatever okay that will be all i hope you like this video please leave comment like and subscribe and don't forget to share if you feel that this video is helpful then see you in the next video thank you